We cut across to a live press conference. Father Tom, who is uh, returned from Syria, he is addressing the media right now. Let's try and listen into what he has to say. I thank you God Almighty for this day. Uh, I bring that to you for this day. For keeping me safe. Because I have conserved well. Healthy, no? Sano. Clear mind. Con una mente chiara. Emotions was in control, of course, now. E anche i sentimenti erano in controllo fino adesso. I do not know. God has used different people to make this day possible. Non lo so, Dio ha usato tantissime persone per far possibile questo giorno. I was taken into captivity on the first Friday of March. I think it is sixth or fifth. Eh, ero preso in cattività il primo venerdì di marzo 2016. Adesso sono 18 mesi. God has been extremely kind to me. Dio è stato molto molto bene a me. No gun was pointed at me. Eh, mai è stato, stata puntata un'arma. I don't want to speak about it. I'll become more emotional about the sisters. Eh, non vorrei parlare troppo delle suore perché divento mi sono commosso. So I so as though it is said, please accept it. Le, per favore accettate quello che ho detto. They have taken me in car different play uh, sono stato uh, portato in macchina in vari posti. I was not trembling, I was not afraid, I did non avevo not cry. paura, non ho pianto. I only prayed God to, to be merciful both for the sisters whom God has called. Ho solo pregato a Dio di avere misericordia verso le suore che hanno perso la vita. And two three others. E due tre altri. Uh, ordinary people, Yemeni, gente, Yemeniti, africani who have sacrificed their life who was looking after the institution anche loro hanno sacrificato la vita erano i custodi dell'istituzione they have not injured me and, and so io non sono stato I knew, maltrattato i knew god jesus has been with me dio gesù è stato con me and in fact for a short distance the eucharistic lord was with me e per the species qualche tempo Avevo anche con me le specie eucaristiche. In the very space where I was made to sit in the car. E nella macchina. And uh, so I said to myself, without the knowledge of God, nothing would happen to me. Ho detto senza il volere di Dio niente succede a me. For Jesus has said, not a hair will fall from your head without the heavenly father's knowledge so do not worry neanche un cappello cade senza do not worry about food or drink what you uh, not, do not worry that jesus had told his disciples that, that phrase or that sentence that words just flashed in my mind sono queste parole che sono venute a mente. That has been. So, I, maybe that's what gave me 
strength e quello che mi ha dato la forza ok uh, to be short on that is so brevemente questo so no they have not injured me at all e my, non mi hanno maltrattato my words will be proved true with the medical tests that are being done e x-rays or riveleranno uh, questa hearing questa ability realtà. sight and uh, all that the proofs are there allora, so there is no, no other injury just no other than the diabetics other than the o diabetes. solo la diabete what else of course they have shifted me from uh, i have no idea which place they kept me non who, sapevo dove ero who all have uh, or which group is involved in erano i miei mm, come si dice raptori raptori uh, e quale gruppo era quello che mi ha rapito but from the car when they took me to the to a house they they reassured me do not worry that they said in english because they speak arabic i don't follow arabic ma quando mi hanno portato in una arabic. casa mi hanno detto do not worry in inglese and eh, we, we have doctors here we will take care of you abbiamo medici qui and e prenderemo cura di te so they have gave me assurance like that the mi very first they maybe i don't know half an hour or 45 minutes so i am not not able to say how much time it to draw or anything forse un un viaggio di mezz'ora 45 minuti ma non sono sicuro well then i think they after reaching the house as yes, they tied my eyes so that i don't see ero blendato who who is coming away. but in the house in a room i had a place uh, a bed la like casa, cushion ne, like stanza, un letto. you can lie down you can sit like that they gave me lunch i think the first meal mi hanno dato il pranzo il water for pasto, drinking when acqua. i needed when i needed to go to the toilet a request made they allowed me to go to the bathroom accompagnato al bagno quando c'era necessità it's a, so i was taken care of quindi mi han, hanno curato abbastanza bene. Certainly they asked which year you came in here Yemen which are places eh, you certo are gone. Mi hanno cercato informazione quando sei arrivato in Yemen. Which are places in India you have traveled which cities Quali you have gone. in India hai visitato. Foreign countries like that. Quali paesi es- I have no reason to hide anything. I just said non avevo truth, which are places I have gone. Non nascondere niente. Allora ho detto quello che volevo. They asked me for phone numbers. I Mi hanno chiesto numeri telefonici. I do, do not even now. I do not remember that any telephone numbers. Anche adesso non ricordo nessun numero. Except one number that's of my mother. Eh. The landline number. <laughs> Il numero della mamma. Uh, because that is repeatedly we but she died to now I think three years. Ma la mamma è morta da tre anni. After she died, uh, of course they now everybody has got the mobile phones and so Adesso the landline it was disconnected. Uh, non funziona la landline. People are uh, not staying in my original home uh, regularly. So that phone, I said, I know only this number, but I know that that phone number is disconnected. This is the number. Um, quindi il numero fisso è stato sconnesso e non funziona è l'unico che conosce il numero della casa They asked whether I, I knew military people government officials I do not know anybody as such Mi hanno chiesto se conoscevo o gente nell'esercito nella, nel governo e io non conosco nessuno Of course I was it was in Eden and in the three churches I asked uh, how many people come for the prayer and from what all nationality i said mainly it is the indians and maybe one or two who are working uh, from other countries in the factories or uh, thing but i do not know their names or phone numbers i don't remember any of these things ero in aden e in aden abbiamo tre chiese 
E nella mia chiesa veniva gente soprattutto indiana, ma qualcun altro anche. And uh, I have been working with Bishop Paul Hinder on the Abu Dhabi. Yemen comes under his jurisdiction. So if at all any person is able to do anything, it's the bishop. Uh, io lavoravo con il vescovo di Abu Dhabi, Monsignor Paul Hinder, e lui è il vescovo del posto incluso Yemen, e allora se c'è qualcuno che potrà aiutare sarà Monsignor Paul Hinder, ha detto. Well, that, that much is the questions they have asked, and uh, I think the following day, or uh, I'm not able to say which day, what day, date, all these things, it's difficult to remember, uh, and no recording it is not possible. And uh, next day or so, I think they made a video making me the first appeal, perhaps, that one. So, allora, il giorno prossimo, uh, and loro hanno girato il primo video. And uh, after two days, that one, the person who speaks uh, in uh, little English is communicating with me. He said, I thought your country will not react. They have responded something. Allora, il giorno dopo, dopo due giorni, la persona che parlava un po' di inglese ha detto, pensavamo che il tuo paese non avesse uh, reagito, invece hanno reagito bene. Well, they must have also contacted others, maybe their first uh, efforts to contact Indian government. Uh, they, their ex expectations were dif different, and uh, the country has proved that also there is a concern, yes. And I am thankful to the President and the Prime Minister and all the ministers concerned, whoever has answered and said the response that gave them hope that uh, something will move. Allora il governo ha mostrato preoccupazione e questo eh, ringrazio il governo eh, perché questo ha dato un po' di speranza a, a questi uomini. Well, the rest, uh, see, like this talking to them, it is not possible. Just when they come ask something like that. So that much, I am the other expression of my thanks to the, to the country leaders and my countrymen. May God bless all of them for that response. So they have not hurt me in any way. Some response came, and uh, perhaps the others also will have uh, responded. Uh, they have not communicated to me anything of Ringrazio il mio paese, tutta la gente del mio paese, <laughs> e per la loro preoccupazione per me. Poi non conosco tutti i dettagli eh, adesso. So this has happened in Edinburgh, I am sure. E questo che è successo in Aden, questo sono sicuro. Uh, maybe after two or three days, I do not know, they shifted me from Aden, which is a hot place, and uh, because of the war, no electricity. Of course, the, play, the room where they kept, there is a, when electricity, an air condition works. So they have shifted me from there to another place in a vehicle. Of course, I, I don't see when they transport me in a, I don't know, in a, in a vehicle. Uh, and took me to another place which may be more safe perhaps for, for my own safety and the climate when I realized dopo due o tre giorni mi hanno spostato in un posto più eh, non era così caldo come Aden it ma is non a, so dove a, it must be the mountainous place where the, where the air is cool probabilmente nelle montagne dove si fa so, più i don't know how far, what is that place, I have no, no idea, so that way. No, there, no idea. I, there I, I think I remain maybe four months, I, I, again, it's only my guessing. Probabilmente sono rimasto quattro mesi in questo paese, ma non sono sicuro. And from there, one more shifting. Da, da lì un altro posto. There I think... Uh, Maybe a, about three months, perhaps. Forse tre mesi in questo posto. And one more shifting. E poi un altro posto. And there I remained till the day of my E lì sono rimasto liberation. fino al giorno della liberazione. No, I do not know. In between they have made uh, videos. 
hanno fatto video delle video in questi mesi just to say the fact the truth i do not know whether uh, you you will have seen in the media perhaps what they posted e non so se va, voi a, a, avete visto quello che hanno they persecuting me i did did you all see if if it is so they have told me beforehand this is only for the video recording do not worry so even if you have seen any action as though they are hitting my head or anything they have not it is like come like this only that i'm like making that. some noise it's only for the video so that uh, seeing that the response may come quickly uh, their request may be granted so i i know those who see it perhaps your heart goes in a different direction here right allora non so se avete visto queste video dove mi maltrattano ma loro hanno detto a lui che e sarà una finta e, e così hanno girato un video per suscitare un po' di interesse. Ok, now you see me how I am and my medical test prove that no such thing is really has happened. E adesso vedete come sono e le, e le cure mediche ci rivelano che non, non ho sofferto. Been, God has been with me. Dio è stato con me. And after I'm released I i have no other means of knowing anything but the whole world must have been praying you all might have made sacrifices the fruits of all that must be that they have not injured me right from the first day non ho, non ho avuto modo di, di conoscere ma sicuramente tanta gente ha pregato stava pregando e, e il frutto di questo era che ero, sono rimasto bene kept my mind serene come ero sereno i i only once or twice i had a little temperature like i tell them and they gave me one paracetamol uh, it's settled once no. or twice in these 18 months solo uno o due volte sono stato the febbre allora the, hanno dato me the stomach moment uh, a little loose i told them they have given the tablet and that's it allora la medicina quando aveva bisogno that's the only ill health as such i felt other than the diabetic weakness oltre la diabete era, erano solo questi due momenti di 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 malattia once they have brought once they have brought a doctor checked up my bp i i was already having hypertension even much before these events i was taking medicines uh, insulin because of the diabetics allora una volta mi hanno portato anche il medico e eh, avevo ipertensione e eh, uh, diabete diabetes and uh, then they gave insulin for they were able to procure insulin for 2-3 days but later they got some the metformin a tablet which the diabetic patients are provided they provided two three times that is one pack of over 30 tablets of 1000 mg then later 500 mg 100 tablets again one more packet when that got over another packet more of uh, 100 tablets so 230 tablets of meant for the diabetics they have procured i don't know how difficult it might have been for them to procure even because it is a war uh, situation it may not be available in the place uh, all that anyway they have provided me that much allora l'insulina una volta l'hanno procurato ma poi varie volte tre volte almeno eh, queste metafun meta metafomin metafomin yes, allora okay. So, dice che è, probabilmente era difficile per loro in questa situazione di guerra ma l'hanno procurato 200 how many 230 times 230 tablets so 230 so one one per day that so like that so you can imagine it. 230 days i had a, some medication for the diabetics allora 230 giorni avevo medicina per la diabete yes not a joke exactly but it does happen also Uh, once they asked me 
How old are you? Una volta non è uno scherzo, ma una volta mi chiedono quanti anni hai. That time I was 58. Allora avevo 58 anni. And that person, don't worry, you will live 85. E allora mi ha assicurato a uh, vivere fino a 85. I celebrated one more birthday. My date of birth is 18th August 1958. So just uh, last month I celebrated my celebrated my birthday in in that place, the second birthday in the, in in captivity. Allora il 18 agosto ho celebrato il mio compleanno il secondo in cattività. So I am 59 complete. Now this is the 60th year. Allora okay. ho 59 anni compiuti. All right, so that is it. If you ask me what was I doing the whole day and night, I could lie down when I want, I can sit up when I get tired of uh, uh, lying down. If they even even told me, you do little exercise. Allora, of course, within the room where I, where I get. So I sometimes used to stand up not for long because the weakness, just to running like just maybe half a minute or one minute, that's all. So, and uh, movement of the hand, all that. They, allora, they, they said, they, so it is a freedom was there, that's what I mean to say. Okay. Uh, mi, se mi chiedete che cosa, come passavo i giorni, ero nella camera, potevo dormire quando volevo, mi hanno chiesto di fare un po' di esercizio e questo ma ho dovuto fare nella, nella stanza un po' di movimento. Ok, regarding that, that's so. so God has been putting into their mind to questions and what was really needed, what provided through them itself. So I am as I am today. Dio ha ispirato quello che hanno chiesto a me mi hanno dato quello che è necessario e sono quello che sono oggi perché Dio ha preso cura di me. So I had a sufficient and more sleep. Ah, ho avuto every, tanto sonno. Every day ho dormito night. bene. Every day or night. E so dormivo it. bene da notte e giorno. I used to spend the time in prayer. Pregavo. I used to celebrate the holy month because they, they are not in the room. If they are in the room, It's difficult, to, but otherwise I am peacefully able to say my Eucharist all from memory. All the bread and wine is not available, but I pray God, give me, the, give, give me in spirit, spiritually, those items. Pray for everyone, right from Pope, bishops, Uh, my Salishan Confriars, certainly Rector Major, and uh, my Provincial, my Bishop, particular those who need a special consolation, I used to remember and pray, and brothers, sisters, relations, enough time, more time was there, I used to pray, pray for those who have uh, died, pray for those who are uh, living, Pray for those who are sick, whom I know, those whom I knew as uh, friends who are working in the country, all that, and to bless all the people who are making efforts and so on. Allora, avevo tanto tempo e quando loro non erano nella stanza, allora celebravo la messa spiritualmente, senza le specie di pane e vino, e pregavo per tantissime persone, il Papa, il Vescovo, il Rettor Maggiore, tanta gente che ho conosciuto nel paese, i, i la famiglia e tante altre persone che e pregavo per tutti, quelli che hanno perso la vita e così via. And those who kept me. E anche per quelli che mi hanno rapito. Certainly, those sisters, those persons whom God had called, yes, All that is there. Sicuramente per le suore che sono morte e le altre persone morte. So that's how my day is gone. And uh, there is, I am not able to remember the whole praises, but uh, just one line, one day at a time, sweet Lord, that uh, uh, him used to come every day. Give me the grace to live this day 
I thank God for that day. Yesterday is gone. Tomorrow is not sure. Give me grace to love this day. Well, Jim... Allora, le, le parole di questa canzone eh, in, in inglese, no? One day at a time, un giorno alla, alla volta. Dammi la grazia per vivere questo giorno. So that sometimes is so. And uh, before going to sleep or when uh, night comes and uh, able to sleep, I thank the Lord. Morning comes. Thank you for this day. And so no other worry was in me. Allora ringraziavo prima di dormire e poi sull'alzarmi anche di nuovo, grazie per questo giorno e non avevo altre preoccupazioni. I thank in the name of the Lord God, even my captors who have been understanding to me and have not heard, it's God's intervention. E ringrazio nel nome di Dio anche questi che mi hanno rapito e non mi hanno maltrattato. And that is due to the prayers and sacrifices of all my brothers and sisters, all of you, the whole world, my own country, other countries, Christians, Muslims, Hindus, all men of goodwill. I'm sure each one would have made the sacrifices. All that has got effect. And I, I am more convinced that if we do not keep selfish motives, keep selfish motives away and do the service, God will be with us and the best weapon against any enemy is love, prayer, forgiveness and prayer it is, has proved may not be within our time of this time frame on earth, God's time is different that I used, to, I used to do to just to get the mental activity I sometimes used to uh, calculate now I don't remember exactly the, how many hours one person will live uh, if you are living 100 years some uh, some it is some two three eight city will come you multiply the number of hours you get you will be able to see so I have reached uh, that time 59 so I have reached this many hours like this <laughs> so that is the distraction that used to be other than the prayer that used to be there I'm a telecommunication technician. I used to be teaching the students electronics, uh, electricity, all that. Sometimes to change the mind to thinking, because you all the time praying, 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 it is difficult, right? So to change and to exercise my memory, I, I have uh, repeated in my mind certain circuits, certain solutions, certain designs, all that. Uh, it has worked. So, in that way the mind keeps going, uh, maybe half an hour or 45 minutes or I don't know, whatever the time. So, the, this is how my days went. One day at a time. Faccio yes. riassunto. Allora, ah, eh, sorry, il fatto che non mi hanno maltrattato, io credo che era dovuto al fatto che tantissimi... All right, uh, that is uh, Father Tom Uzunalil. Uh, he is a priest from Kottayam in Kerala. He was abducted on the 4th of March back in 2016 by the Islamic State and released just recently on the 12th of September, released from Yemen and taken to Vatican. And this is for the first time that he's come out in front of the media and uh, given out details of what happened during those 18 months when he was held captive by Islamic State terrorists. That's the gist of it. Let's get in. Uh, we on Mohammed Saleh for more on this, uh, Saleh. Uh, give us uh, some points that were significant. Of course, this was the first time that he's addressing media, uh, telling people what happened. It, it, it was a tough time indeed for Father Tom. That's exactly correct, Sana. You know, this, this uh, address that he actually, for the first time, having come out from the captivity of the ISIS and when he was addressing the media, you know, one could clearly make out the amount of trauma that he must have in fact gone through ever since he was abducted way back in March 2016. Remember, at the time that he was abducted, there were a lot of propaganda videos which were put out by ISIS. Uh, so a lot, of, a lot of people expected that he'd actually make it out of the captivity of ISIS alive. Uh, right from day one, the Indian government had been carrying out its diplomatic efforts. He was actually captured from the city of Aden in Yemen. Um, where he was, you know, a part of a missionary, um, and which, which was in fact providing aid to some of the people there. And from the time that he was 
captured by the ISIS. There was very little hope because initially one of the first accusations that had been leveled against him was that he was carrying out conversion activities in Yemen and it was considered almost virtually impossible for you know anyone to perhaps secure his release from the Islamic State. At that time, in 2016, Islamic State was of course much more powerful. It is now a shadow of itself. Uh, so, uh, you know, Father Tom's release was very, very difficult to predict at the time that he had been uh, captured by the ISIS. But eventually, due to the diplomatic efforts of India and also because of the intervention of the King of Oman, uh, you know, eventually his, secure, uh, his release has been secured. And now he's come out in this very moving address with the media, come out and said, look, it is, it is by the grace of God that I'm here in front of you. I was captured, but my captors treated me well. They fed me. They did not hit me like what was being portrayed in some of the propaganda videos that, that were being shot. They even got medicines for the diabetes that I suffer from. And, and this is the picture that he's in fact put out where he said that he clearly had lost track of the time as to how long he was held in captivity. And in the first address, he also has thanked the governments. You know, there were several governments which were working together to right. try and get the release of Father Tom in this case here.